Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a vlog from April of last year. I am now getting around to editing it and then uploading it. Sorry, it's kind of a little late. It's better late than never. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Subscribe down below. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, and I'll see you guys next time. Today is quite, quite, quite the busy week, and I do have something to do every day this week. The two days that I have off I have appointments, so I will be taking you guys along that. This week is just gonna be a busy week. Right now, it is about six o'clock in the morning. I did wake up a little bit earlier today because I have to go to work from 11 to 4.45. And then at Starbucks, at my location at least, we do our clean plays on Sundays, and we didn't do it yesterday. My manager wants us to try out doing the clean play from 8.30 to 11, but this is gonna be our first time doing it today. I'm not not exactly sure how it's gonna work mainly because of the fact that a lot of the stuff that we actually have to do has to be done after business hours i have a spring break vlog that i filmed last month that i still have not uploaded i'm gonna take the next hour and just edit <laughs> so weird right now i have allergies so in the morning i tend to cough quite a lot and then sometimes it sounds like i have a frog stuck in my throat i got to about nine minutes and 38 seconds so i'm just going to minimize this and then now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna open up my canvas website right now and look at my calendar and look to see what i have upcoming this week i know that i have an activity that's gonna be due tomorrow so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm going to just look over it. It'd be really nice if we can get over with tonight, but I'm just gonna see what my period covers and start on that. I'm just gonna go ahead and read 8.1 and 8.2, take some notes on it, and then also review the Zoom lecture that the teacher went over for these two chapters. <laughs> iPad, I pulled up my PowerPoints for 8.1 and then I also did 8.2. So I'm gonna go ahead and watch the PowerPoint presentation on this and then take notes. I went to go use it and it wasn't actually drawing anything and then as I put it on my iPad, I then realized that it just needed a little bit of charge. I'm gonna charge my iPad, I'm gonna charge my camera, I'm gonna go and have some breakfast and hopefully in like the next hour it should be charged not all the way but just a little bit. Just give me a little bit more juice in order to watch these presentations. and I'm about to head off to work. So I 
just got home. It's about 12.20 the next day. But yeah, I'm gonna just go ahead and put on my PJs. I already put my alarms for tomorrow. Tomorrow I have a Zoom lecture at 9.30. I'm waking up at 6 because we have an activity due before then. I'm just gonna go ahead and get ready for bed and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I just made it to work. It's about 10.44. And yeah, my Zoom lecture went really well. She does want us to read the chapter for the next section because she told us like right before she ended the call that she was gonna ask us a question based on like the textbook. So I'm going to definitely make sure that I do that. I work from 11 to 4.45 today. So how was your... We can't talk about that. That's like rated R stuff, first of all. This is a PG channel, just so you know. <laughs> It was good. Okay, that's great. The smile on my face. Some chocolate milk, and I'm just sitting here on my bed about to watch one of the new Sim Tracker videos. <laughs> I took my mom and her friend to the airport this morning at around five o'clock and then I had some breakfast and then I didn't really do anything. I just waited until it was time for me to go to work. I actually ordered an acai bowl from Granny Berry before I headed out. I thought I had to stay until 8.45, but then it turns out it was a bit of a miscommunication. So I didn't end up having to stay until 8.45. I stayed until 4.45, but then on my 10, I just had like some of the acai bowl and I just finished it for dinner. I already fed my dog. I'm just gonna wait until probably like 7 30 like I normally do to take her out for another walk I'm gonna go ahead and do some laundry because I know I have laundry I need to get done when I made my physical therapy appointment I made it for Thursday but then I realized this morning that I actually have to go to school in terms of like I have a zoom lecture at 9 30 on Tuesdays and Thursdays and I don't know why that didn't like recollect in my brain so I did change that appointment until Friday. Tomorrow I have off and then Friday I also have off. So I'm gonna honestly spend me some time just relaxing, doing some homework, editing the video, going to my appointments. I am filming this on my iPad so it's a little weird. I feel like I'm really like in the corner and I also feel like my face is ginormous. I did take a shower when I got home and my hair looks a little crusty dusty. I just had to read section 9.2 because on Tuesday my teacher basically told us that she was going to give us like an extra credit if we gave her an answer to a question like a private comment. So she told us that it would be best for us to read the section for it was like five or ten minutes of just reading all of this. I am now going to just go ahead and get ready for bed. I did take a nap today for about an hour and 15 minutes. I did put it in my first load of laundry. Um, I'm gonna do the rest tomorrow. It's about 9.29. I have my laptop set up and then I have some Fruity Pebbles that I'm gonna have for breakfast. I had an alarm for 8.30 this morning, but I didn't wake up until 8. And then I just stayed in my bed until about 8.40. I took a shower, I got ready, and then I walked my dog and I just now fed her so she's having her breakfast. I'm just gonna go ahead and sit in the dining room and have my breakfast while my class is on. Too many guys think I'm a concept or I complete them or I'm gonna make them alive. Yeah. 
It's about 11.09 and the class finished, I would say around 10.15. And then once I was done with that, I just sat on my phone for a little bit. And then a neighbor actually knocked on my door because she just needed like milk for something that she's doing. So I gave her that. I just kind of organized this because I did have my laptop over here and I washed the dishes over there. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and wash my face. I am gonna iron my hair. Once I'm done ironing my hair, I'm gonna go ahead and take my dog out for her second morning walk. And then after that, I'm actually planning on editing the spring break vlog that I still haven't uploaded. But I do wanna do some editing before I have my eye appointment today and then a little bit after. And then a little bit once I'm done coming back from my eye appointment. Because these two days I don't have work, it's gonna be really nice to kind of just catch up on vlogs, catch up on some homework because this semester is actually almost over for me. I am back from my walk with my dog and I just served myself some chips and salsa. I did print out the paperwork for tomorrow for my physical therapy and I'm just gonna sit here with my computer and start to edit for about an hour. So this is what I'm wearing. I actually got this shirt a while ago and it's from Urban Outfitters and it's their like really long kind of distressed t-shirts and then I'm just wearing some leggings. I'm not gonna wear these socks. I'm just wearing these socks just to be around the house. So I was about to come over here and get something for lunch and I just found my dogs just while well, she was laying. But now that she heard me, she said no. She loves to just be by the window just to kind of see what's going on. So I just put this into the microwave. It's from Amy's bowl. I'm having this for lunch today. This is what I'm gonna have and I'm now sitting down on my desk editing my video. When I was eating the chips, I was actually watching the newest Tom Tracker video when he went to Epcot and just kind of tested out to see if Disney's Epcot Flower and Garden Festival had like allergy free dairy-free and gluten-free food options so that's what I watched before but now I'm actually sitting down on my desk I'm gonna edit this video until 2 and then at 2 I'm gonna go ahead and walk my dog before I leave for my appointment she got a smile got me waiting for the weekend couple tests spend a check tell her bring a friend she got a taste on the lips like a sweet leg leaving work early just to see you again like I got somebody let them all know like a blue confetti what you got, little Niles gon' get him yeah. Top 10 billboards already read it now you know where the kitty's at walking up on the I just made it to my eye appointment. I'm in my car right now, but I'm about to head off. I haven't seen an eye doctor in probably probably a good year, probably a good over a year. And I've had these glasses for over a year, and I think it's about time for me to change them. And then recently I actually ran out of my contacts, so I want to get new contacts. Probably my prescription has changed. Because I have a stigmatism of something, I'm not exactly sure what. So when I went inside for my appointment, the guy at the register came up to me after I signed up the two pieces of paper that I need to sign and basically told me that my insurance doesn't cover for vision. And basically what that means, if you guys don't actually know, as the patient, you have to pay out of pocket for every visit and anything else that happens. So now I need to go back home. I need to see what my insurance actually covers, if it actually does cover vision or not. But right now I am at Target because I need to pick up a few things. After this, I'm gonna go to the bank and just put in the tip money that I got from this week into my account. That way I don't have like extra cash on me. Toes. What you say when the living don't stop, I be making my way, yeah, yeah. So what you wanna when you wanna say, show sure that. I just got back from Target. I'm about to put away these things. I did pick up this, which is by Once Upon a Farm, the organic dairy-free smoothie. I saw this on Lauren's Instagram, and then I found it at Target, and I really, really want to try it, which is something that I should be looking into because I am allergic to dairy. So I think I'm going to go ahead and try this right now. I really, really love mango. They're literally my favorite fruit of all time.
It's a very dreamy flavor. It's almost like a little kid smoothie. I personally would say that it's okay. I wouldn't say that it's the best thing ever. I'm gonna go ahead and put all these groceries away. And then I'm gonna take my dog out for a little walk before dinner. So I got some barbecue chips. I got some some chips. These are the garden salsa. These are literally my favorite chips of all time. Because of the fact that I want to start working out again, I got some protein bars. These are by Quest and I've had these before. This is the birthday cake flavor. And then this is the chocolate chip cookie dough flavor. I got the Fruit Loops one and then I got the honey bunch of oats with almonds. And then I got milk. This one is for my mom and this is for me this is just regular plain oat milk and this is lactose free two percent reduced fat milk treats for my dog i have a new toothbrush a new body wash this is from raw sugar and it's the raw coconut and mango this is just a little kong for my dog this is just the verse brightening serum because i ran out these are just two frozen meals this is by amy bowles and this is the tortilla casserole and black beans and this is a new one that i want to try it's the cauliflower mac and cheese bowl. And then I got some orange juice. And I got another one of these. I'm gonna show you the three shirts that I got and the one pair of shorts. I got this gray Jurassic Park shirt. I also got this mustardy shirt with all these cacti on it. And I just got a plain simple tank top. I also bought the highest rise shorts. I'm gonna go ahead now that I put everything away and take Luna out for her walk. Front back to pass one. Say what you want and when you want to say She'll laugh right back and pass one Go get it, go, oh, go get it Go get it, go, oh, go get it Break it out like girl can act Bring it on up like damn that This is my dinner These are my little french toast and This is the bacon that I went to a supermarket to go get um, Because I really want bacon tonight So I finished having my dinner And then while I was also at the supermarket I got this carrot cake that I've had before I'm not exactly sure if I've shared it in a vlog before But it's so good I have some milk with it And then obviously my dog's right here Trying to beg for food I'm now sitting down on my desk and i'm about to fill out the paperwork for my physical therapy appointment i'm also going to sign in for the website that i'm gonna get my mri scan and see if i have to do any paperwork before i get there it's about 10 33 i want to do this in the next 20 minutes yes. girls gonna check them out bounce my pad sipping my drink like clown can dance go dumb I've been tweaking till the morning I've been rolling but the pen's got me writing Off like a throne gon' get it Beer thrown, let it hang, girl gon' set it down She got a smile, got me waiting for the weekend Couple tests, been a check I went to my physical therapy appointment the first Day that you typically go it's an evaluation and they basically check your range of motion they ask to see what type of problems do you have what concerns do you have how did your injury affect you i basically this is my second time i think going to physical therapy and it's because of the fact that i dislocated and popped into my left knee out a couple years ago and i literally just need the strength back in my hip and in my in my thigh so that's what we're gonna do for the next month which i think a lot of it is just gonna go back to the same physical therapy exercises that i did before she gave me back some exercises that i'm going to be doing every day i'm gonna see her again on wednesday and she seems really nice i just had some pdq i have another appointment to get my thyroid mri scan today just to see if through an mri it looks enlarged when i did get my my blood work a few weeks ago with the doctor said that it doesn't really look like I have hyperthyroid because I used to have it and then I think I just got controlled a little bit so I have an appointment at two to get that done I'm about to go and do that right now I made it to my MRI scan appointment I'm about 15 minutes early I'm actually gonna go in right now because they emailed me earlier like throughout the week just a reminders and they asked me to like sign some papers but when i did it this morning i couldn't get the photo for like my insurance to get put on their system so i'm just gonna go in early right now because i know that it takes a good like 
10 to 15 minutes just to fill out paperwork. They always ask you for like 25, thousand pounds of just information it is now saturday and it's about 10 o'clock in the morning i woke up this morning around 6 30 i did a workout and then after that i took my dog out for her first little morning walk i had some coffee and then i had some toast and nutella but right now i'm gonna go ahead and take my dog out for her really long walk i also need to show you guys my calendar for this week and next week i said at the beginning of this vlog that i was going to show you how busy i am but i haven't showed you guys that so i'm gonna show you guys that once I come back from my walk with my dog. And then after that, I'm gonna go ahead and put the dishes away because there are dishes in the dishwasher that I have not taken out. You never wanna pick up. You never wanna do the things that are and put all the dishes away now that i'm standing in front of my calendar so today is this day and this was all this week so as you can tell i had work monday tuesday wednesday and then i had an eye doctor appointment and then a physical therapy appointment and an mri appointment and then again i'm also quite busy with work next week this is a pdc which is basically a partner development conversation i think that's what the initials mean so you get with your manager and they talk to you about where do you want to excel? Where do you see yourself lacking? What do you want to improve on? So I do have that next week on Thursday. So my only really day off is next week on Wednesday. And I did make an eye appointment for that day, but I think I'm going to change it until Thursday afternoon. I'm just going to go ahead and just make the bed. It's about 10.54 right now. So I'm going to go ahead and make the bed and I'm going to start getting ready to go to work. Okay, I know that now. It is now 11.20 and I just got in my car. I'm actually leaving about five minutes before I usually do. I'm just gonna go ahead and drive to work. I'll see you guys soon. I am back from work. It's about 5.30 right now. I'm gonna go ahead and take her out for like a quick little walk and then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna shower and then I'm gonna feed her and then probably around 6.30. I'm gonna take her for more of a longer walk. But yeah, work was pretty good today. I did do the handheld for about an hour and 45 minutes where we go outside and we have a little handheld machine that tells us every single order on there. It was really hot outside. Pretty good day actually. This is what I'm having for dinner. This is from the same frozen meal box that I got at Target and then I'm just drinking some Sprite and then over there is my coffee that I had from work. Three times grab a protractor, measure distance between us so I'm always at um, it's about 8.43. I woke up this morning at 5.30 because I knew that I was gonna have to go to work from 12 to 5. And then I also had the clean play at like 8.30. So I knew I wasn't gonna have enough chance to do anything today. As I was editing my video, I did get a text message from a shift letting me know if it was possible for me to come in at nine today to kind of help the morning crew with like peak. I said yes. So I took my dog out at around 6.30 and then I had breakfast, I fed her and then I took her out again around 7.30. I gave her what I showed you in the video of like a little peanut butter thing. I did text my neighbor to see if it was possible for her to walk moon around around 12 because I do think that it's gonna rain today but it says that it's not gonna rain until after three. Yeah, I'm here for eight hours. So this is gonna be a very long day for me. It's now 6.25 and this is what I'm having for dinner. I made it with an acai packet that I already had and I kind of just put it in my Nutribullet and then I just laid it on top of this bowl and I just put it in the freezer. I did shower. I have to go back to work at 8.30 because I have the clean play. I hope that today is actually the last day that we do the clean play from 8.30 to 11. While I'm eating this, I have an extra credit assignment due tonight. So I'm gonna quickly look at that, see what I have to do, and then hopefully turn it in before I leave. And I 
probably you know should have done it yesterday or the day before but i procrastinate it is now 7 37 i'm gonna go ahead and do the five sets of exercises that i have to do for my physical therapy i'm gonna show you guys what they are on like a little graphic once i'm done now call mr rogers if you're drinking from the well i'm suburbanly suburban on oh, case you couldn't tell when my show with the belt grab it real good keep my pants far from hell looking real good got me wrapped up in a bow or your flow well minor episode and the win if i would have stayed till you're okay i know that now you tell all your so these are the six exercises that i have to do here's the first four and here's the last two i'm done with that i'm gonna go and just put my hair in a braid i don't know if i want to do two separate braids or just one whole braid i think i'm gonna just do one whole dutch braid Friends that i'm obsessed now let's get real a little bit in the back so that way it doesn't look so structured and kind of looks a little bit more messy i know that my little dutch braid isn't really perfect honestly i just try with what i have let's show you the back kind of looks like i have an afro going on i feel like when i have my hair like this it also kind of looks like i don't have a lot of hair and this is what i'm leaving my dog in i did put like the little fairy lights that i have on i'm just gonna leave my dog on top of the bed because she's just gonna sleep there i'm about to give her some treats and then i'm gonna head out now I'm evil.